I'm kind of suspicious because uh, your relationship ended just in time for prom season. What's that about? Well, you know, I like uh, I like getting in a limo. I like a nice limo ride. To please go to a prom this year. You want me to go to a prom? <laughs> please go to a prom. There's got to be one 17 year old girl out there that what needs girl a prom wants to date. go to a prom. I'll take her to the prom. That'd be the start. It's a hacky radio <laughs> fit. Go but to the prom. But please. Oh, it wouldn't be a radio pit. That's what I'm saying. That's why we would actually think <laughs> about doing it. How horrible would that be? The father beats me up because I'm fucking <laughs> pounding his Dude, girl in the back seat. On, on tomorrow's? Uh, that's awful. Tomorrow's show, we're going to we're gonna have uh, potential dates call you. <laughs> Only a prom date, though. We're not looking for any other. That's prom date. Hi, Anthony. <laughs> I don't have a date for the prom. You'll take care of all that on your own. We're looking for a prom date for you, though. A prom date? I, I bet you there's one or two listeners that would actually do this. Yeah. But they have to put out. So they, have... <laughs> they have to put out. In well, the ass. No. <laughs> yeah, you have to open up your ass for it. There's no putting out. That's right. You got to give Anthony yeah. a stinky mushroom. That's fucking like... Uh... You got to give up the brown eye for Anthony if you want to. You got to let him shoot potato, potato flakes in your face. You let a Cheerio and ride yeah. the tailpipe. <laughs> Fucking tailpipe. <laughs> so, got to let him grab a potato spot and tailpipe. Pull it out, put potato flakes all over your right knuckle. <laughs> Stink wrinkle. <laughs> rink knuckle? <laughs> no, he called it the... He, a rink knuckle? He, yeah, he called it the stink knuckle. Stink wrinkle. The Let's... asshole is the tailpipe. Uh, <laughs> potato flakes is, yeah, your dried cum. <laughs> He's the worst, man. I love that guy. I love him. Uh, he had a million of them. Sewer. Oh, I yeah. can't remember. We have to... We, we said in the past, we got to get a montage of all those. Just you got to give Anthony a rusty trombone with Chuck Mangione playing in the background. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and accurately play it. Dude, I think <laughs> like, there would actually be a girl sync. that will call tomorrow ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. and see if you're <laughs> serious about this prom thing. Would you do it? Uh, yeah, I would I would go to the... What if you uh, made it 18 so you don't get arrested? So there's some girls that are already 18. 17 in New York, according to... Legal? Uh, well, according to um, ageofconsent.com. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> That's how you know you're a piece of shit if you have that bookmark. <laughs> if you have that, yeah, right? Let me just, uh... No, that's your homepage. <laughs> just in case. <laughs> uh, um, so we got that's our funny. animation contest, and now we got the Open Up Your Ass for Anthony contest, which will start tomorrow. <laughs> Open Up Your Ass. 16 in New Jersey for any, uh, anybody who has a Jersey prom. How do you know this? Now, it, was, uh, it was a bit I was doing. Oh, okay. Yeah, you were researching a bit. I was, researching a, I was bit. researching a bit. Yeah. yeah. Called living as a pederast. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, and Pete Townsend was researching a book. All right. We got lots of contests to do tomorrow. Open mm -hmm. up your ass for Anthony, and we got to start talking about our animation festival. Yeah. Animation Palooza, I think it's called. But, yes, I like animation. Well, animation festival is going to be the. Anima, that's going to be the working. I don't know. Animation festival is going to be the. Cartoon Palooza. Uh, that is, was it. It's going to be the working name. Yeah. It's not going to be the official name. Cartoon Palooza. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I, you have to go to a prom. You have to. Oh my god! And, really and, and this is this is what it is. Girls got to be legal, depending on what state. That, Damn it. You go to the prom, <laughs> and she has to put out a little. No, what is a little? Just a little. little. Like, what is that? Like, you get to, like, squeeze her little boobie. <laughs> and I'm going to be squeezing any movie. You have to squeeze her little boobie. How horrible is it for a... And you don't even have to go under her dress or anything. Just from on the outside. Like, let's negotiate with these but girls. But I have to come over, though, and as the parents are taking pictures, <laughs> yes. I got to pin a corsage on her. Yes. But she has to agree oh, that later God. on the night, when mommy and daddy are gone, you get to squeeze her booby a little bit. Yeah. And maybe touch the top of Patch. <laughs> I can't touch the top of Patch. Well, we got to negotiate. It doesn't work like that. I guarantee we'll find a girl that's that called is dead serious date about rape. taking you to their prom. There's something called date rape. If uh, not, if she agrees. Yeah, even if she agrees, if she doesn't want to, huh? Uh, it's date rape. You don't want to get into there, do hey, what you? what are you, a mind reader? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we I guess we found a subject that Dan's ready to talk oh, about. Jesus Christ. We've been oh. throwing lobs at you all day. You finally <laughs> hit one back. All right, Dan, let's get into this a little bit. <laughs> Lord Shire Horses. Isn't it Horst? 
We forgot that guy's name right, Jimmy. Lord <laughs> Shirehorse. Shirehorst. Says there's a girl available for the daddy-daughter dance if anyone is interested. Daddy-daughter <laughs> dance. <laughs> How about she has? <laughs> how about she has to touch your giant hog through your tuxedo? No, that's no. Why? Oh God! I'm just helping a brother out here. It's pretty embarrassing. Tim W. Uh, Tim W. from Rochester, the home of Brother Wee's, always will be. He writes: Anthony Prom equals pink sock hop. <laughs> Uh, All right, we got so much to talk about and think of. Yeah, think about yeah. for tomorrow's show. Open up uh, your Ask for Anthony contest starts tomorrow officially. I I don't think. Let me let me. I'm just gonna what go off on a limb here and say I don't think we're really gonna get many contestants if that's the name of the um the contest. Huh? I don't think we're gonna get a lot of uh, takers because if it's a prom thing, then you're talking you know girl that. With the parents, and if it's open up your ass, <laughs> Jim, Jimmy, do you have a problem with the name of the contest? Yeah, I think it should be open up your asshole. I think open up your ass is too vague. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Yeah, hey, too much, too fucking much. You really have a problem with the name? That's weird. Well, and Voss must have a daughter that's. Uh, Doing the prom this year? Yes, I I spent some time talking with um, the Voss daughters at one of the. Uh, that was the most uncomfortable thing I've ever oh, experienced. Was Rich just infuriated? Oh. He was so pissed. I got her phone number, and she, Rich just was. He wanted to punch me. He wanted to punch me in the head. Like I wasn't ever gonna use it, but it was just funny because I knew it annoyed the shit out of Rich. Mm -hmm. I was offering her drinks. Ah, there's a, there's, <laughs> like offering there's, a booth. There's a bit of realism there. I was standing what? right there. I was like, <laughs> just talking. Hey, by the way, uh, yes, I'm sorry, Shay, and uh, to everybody else that uh, have been with us a long time. Shay from Connecticut writes, come on, Aunt. Remember how much better everything is when you put teen in front of it. So it really should be open up your teen ass. <laughs> oh, oh. Pull. <laughs> Thank you, man. <laughs> Jimmy's, Jimmy's roll. Wait, all right, so now we're up to open up your teen ass pause hole for Anthony contest. <laughs> can't possibly work. Jimmy, we can't get contestants for the change thing. So <laughs> we're up to open up your teen ass he hole. Open up your teen ass hole for no, Anthony. No, no, no. Make sure you got the pause in there, Jimmy. Or how about... Um, if if it's too long to put that on a flyer, how about this? Uh, prom cunt. <laughs> <laughs> how about prom cunt? You're the winner of the prom cunt contest, which means you get to get me, Anthony Cumia, a big celebrity with an even bigger cock and huger bank account, to take you, the pig, to your prom. <laughs> First prize is you drink a load out of my balls. That's also second and third prize. Fourth prize is you get your ass and pussy fucked in that order. All right, we're on to some, man. <laughs> and bear with us. We're on That's to right. something here. I drop you off at the end of the evening with a fucking with a load stuck to your back, and your fucking your stupid needing money father comes out and cleans my cock <laughs> off with your mother's wedding gown. At least the strapless dress will. will <laughs> at least the strapless dress will stay on after all that <laughs> cum on your back. <laughs> all right, and prom cunt. Uh, and are you brought to you by the Opie and Anthony program? <laughs> and are you in? People are very excited. They're, they're typing in That's caps right. at this point. This will never work. That's right. And you, have, yeah. and you get to do a special <laughs> dance. Right. You get to do a fucking. You, you get to slow dance with this slob. <laughs> After a Cialis with your big dick pressing against her, <laughs> right, uh, they right. play the chicken dance at the prom. <laughs> and you slow dance with this fucking manatee. Uh, yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> prom cunt. She has, you know what she has to do? She has to fucking drain a load out of your balls and then go fucking knuckle deep in your asshole. And then fucking her father gets to smell the fingers for extra money and guess which one was in your ass. And if, if, he, if, he, guesses, if he guesses right, you don't punch his daughter in the face. <laughs> Prom cunt. Sponsored by XM Satellite Radio. We're void, we void where prohibited. <laughs> We're definitely on to something, oh, but shit. more suggestions coming hey, in. Instead of open up them. your teen ass <laughs> hole for Anthony contest, uh, they're suggesting that we adjust it just slightly and and uh <laughs> 
and rename it. <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck did it go? Uh, All right. Get to pin her corsage on right into her fat torso. <laughs> and you just stick it right into her. You just what you do is you fucking put a safety pin through a plastic flower. Yeah. And you just fucking palm it right yeah. into her fat tit. Yeah. What Here you, you go, slobo. You might have Come on, slobo. Time to head to the dance. Holy fucking shit. maybe you can roll a marble oh. on the dance floor and then hit her on the back and she'll eat it like hungry hungry hippo. <laughs> <laughs> That's the fucking prom song you dance to. Hungry, hungry hippo. <laughs> then you fucking, you stick your dick right in her shitter in the parking lot. <laughs> and dad picks her up. <laughs> she has to fucking sit on her side. She can't even sit properly. <laughs> on the fucking side bone. <laughs> How was it? What's up? <laughs> let's, uh, let's Google bomb the name of this contest so we get a little, uh, oh, so it has God. some legs. The only thing, and you might have to come up with, like, um, first semester uh, tuition for a college, but that's easy. You fucking wear a white, a white tuxedo, a white tuxedo yeah. to show the fucking damage on the front. You want her father, just by the colors on the front of it, to know how many holes you got in. Well, I see a clear crustacean mixed with red, but no brown. Thank God, my girl, she kept her on her. She saved her asshole. <laughs> Douglas uh, from Holy Austin shit, writes, my, my, You're fucking killing me. my daughter was demolished by Anthony Tuesday. <laughs> well, here's uh, Don the Trucker. He writes, uh, open up your teen ass hole. Very good with the dot, dot, dot. Thank you, Don. And uh -huh. give Mel Karmas in a heart attack contest. <laughs> uh, okay, like that, man. Yeah. Uh, what do you say? Are you in? Uh, you got to be in. You want to sleep on it? You know, okay, we, uh, run, it, run it past Logan. Yeah, see what he thinks about see that. How, see how that goes past that uh, ELO. Right. And there's a special bonus <laughs> when the fucking millionaire comes to pick up your fucking white trash daughter. Your wife can suck his balls and then wipe her fucking brow with his pubes. What do you think of that, you fucking cuckold? And the millionaire will throw a few bucks at you. And you, you and your wife can both fish around on the linoleum for them. <laughs> <laughs> the way Sonny threw the money down at the camera, and I think he could throw a few fucking tens down. Oh, here you go, fetch. Oh shit! I, I found those legs. I found the line, by the way. We're just uh, just in the the first word of the contest to pull open your teen ass hole for Anthony <laughs> contest. Uh, it's very it's a subtle change, but I think it gets the point across. Well, pull open implies <laughs> that she's putting her hands in her ass cheeks. Yeah. And like using her middle fingers from each one and just grabbing the cheek and, and physically opening it harshly. Right. <laughs> you know, the way one would fucking, uh, what would you open? You know when you try to open a new piece of electronics, it comes in that fucking hard plastic shell. Yes. You finally get a knife in there and you have to position your, your, your fingers in there and pull. Like that's how you're going to open your fucking... <laughs> Yes. You're frightened prom asshole. <laughs> supposed to be the biggest night of your life, and you're going home with a millionaire's load in your fucking pubes. <laughs> what do you think of that, this big night? <laughs> take your fucking, take your corsage out and fucking vomit. Yeah. <laughs> so we could, we'll need an answer. You can sleep on it. Oh. All right? All right. To either that or, uh, or uh, Black Panther... Hunting. No, there's no Black Panther hunting. All right, so you're open to this idea, right? <laughs> oh, oh yeah, this will go. Over and she's fat, right? so we have to put a little thing around her, and we'll call it a cummerbund. <laughs> <laughs> open your hole for Anthony's pole contest, uh, Stig. Yes, uh, ream your teen contest, three line Jim C. Uh, well. <laughs> Dry Blood is suggesting we go with the contest. Uh, we name it The Cock of Love. <laughs> well, it has to be a prom theme. Yeah, of course. Yeah, it yeah. certainly does, Jimmy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, good. I think we're on to something. Yeah, yeah, I like that prom rapist. <laughs> I like prom rapist. <laughs> where you, can, you, you have to be 18 or, or older to enter, but you can, uh, you can enter for a chance to win a brutal assault on your prom <laughs> night by fucking Anthony in the limo in, in your driveway. And then he fucking speeds off in his Shelby. <laughs> well, you show up at your own prom with a black eye. Yeah, because he really has better things to do than hang out with you all night. You show up with a black eye and try to make the most of it, you fifth wheel. Yeah, you, you'll, you'll spend all day getting all pretty... You'll spend all day getting ready for your prom. 
And Ant's only going to be with you for five minutes. That's right. The Shelby will still be running. That's right. A nice assault right in the limo in your fucking... That's right. Right in your driveway while your parents wave stupidly. Right. They have no idea what's going on in the backseat. Boy, they sure are in the driveway for a long time. And they fucking see the window crack. And they have a feeling it might have been your head getting smashed against it on the inside, but they're not sure. Right. Holy <laughs> fucking! All right, we gotta decide on a name. <laughs> we gotta decide on a name because my bro's ready to go into production with the t-shirts. Oh so what God. are we going with? Pull open. <laughs> um, I'm sick motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> what, what what is gonna be on the t-shirt? Pull open. We haven't uh, figured. Brother out. Elmo, we need a t-shirt for this. <laughs> it's brilliant. <laughs> it's brilliant in how simple it is. <laughs> The Mil Milk Anthony's uh, pole contest? <laughs> <laughs> Milk Anthony like a cow? Yeah. It just isn't going to fucking work. Why? Right. What What seems to be the problem? Right. Everything. We could adjust uh, the name a little bit. A little? Yeah, but, you know. Oh, God. That's right. We'll give him a little bit on the name, but the rest of it we get, we got to be tough about. I'm going to be fucking And bring your appetite. <laughs> bring your appetite. You're going to be sucking a lot of load. <laughs> That's right. Maybe we could just call it your special night, right? But it's so sarcastic, All right? Because your special night, well, special fucking, and quotation. Your special night, yeah. It fucking you never make it into the dance. You're yeah. fucking you're drinking Anthony's goat cheese, yeah. In the fucking in the, in yeah. the back of the limo. Yeah. Let's <laughs> let's get a, a, a rider together, oh, and and make her the only girl that sucks cock on the dance floor while everyone else is slow dancing around her. <laughs> Yeah, you have, to, you have to service Anthony on the dance floor. On the dance floor while everyone else is... Oh, my God. You know, thinking that they're in love. While they're all dancing and falling in love. Right. You have to hold fucking cocktail franks in one hand right. and blow the millionaire. That's right. Cocktail franks in your hand. And it's a, and it's a giant hog, so you're not going to be able to hide what you're doing from anyone. Why cocktail franks? Because we said so. That's right. Pigs in a blanket. Yeah, pigs in a blanket. Oh. Cocktail weenies, fatty. <laughs> Hold them. I can't fucking take this. Just so your fingers smell like hot dog franks <laughs> on the way home. <laughs> and, you know, and this will show how good we are. We're good guys here. We will supply the diaper after Anthony ruins your ass so you can enjoy the rest of the prom. Right. <laughs> Without fucking butterscotching your new dress. No one wants to butterscotch while the fucking, while your prom song is playing. Your date can meet you there. After Kumia wrecks you in the fucking limo, you can get out and see your stupid senior date. <laughs> right. He stands there with a fucking corsage, a flower to hand you. Yeah. And a, and a goofy emo look. Exactly. Uh, yeah. What he should be handing you is fucking Oxycontin and anal stitches. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ant. We're, we're so on to something here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we're on to something. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Did you write all that down, Dan? Oh, yeah. Dan oh, wrote it all down. God we're gonna, we're gonna run it by uh, Washington. We had no room for fucking no no vague language in yeah, this please. contest. <laughs> we insist. This has to be. We insist on this one. We want the lawyers we're to approve this one. <laughs> right. Not willing to budge. That's right. Not willing to budge on this one. Not willing to budge on this one. We've budged oh. enough over the years. This oh. this is one they need to give to us. Or how about chocolate prom? <laughs> where at the end at the end of the night, uh -huh. for your prize, you fucking lay back in the limo and fucking Kumia drops a shit right in your mouth <laughs> and then leaves without an explanation. <laughs> Pac Q from Philly writes the deep dick under the sea. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah, we get some potential with chocolate. Prom. Absolutely. <laughs> you all right with uh, this ant? <laughs> oh yeah, just run it past Washington. All right, we'll run it go up really point. well. We're gonna we're gonna hope that they blue sky this by Wednesday. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm sure it will be. I'm sure we'll have to let it bake for a day or two, but just <laughs> after that we should be good to go. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right. I'm going to be laughing all fucking day because of Jimmy. I'm Anthony Cumia, and I approve this message.